Hello and welcome back guys, it's DT Cody and sorry I haven't uploaded in the last few days. Um, I've actually been, well, last week, week in about three days. Um, my internet's been really sluggish. Um, I think it was because I was actually doing too many uploads because I was trying to upload every day. So I'm going to be doing an upload every two to three days. Um, I'm going to constantly record from now on because I've actually done a lot of work um, in the past week trying to get it all up to scratch so you guys can see some more more things in the park going on so we can start on the larger projects and whatnot. Um, but news number one just then though 12 has now joined over into the faction um, he's now a part of Masrani and yeah so we've got a few more people that are joining the faction shortly um, and yeah so a lot has changed I probably should have recorded all of it but oops my bad um, but yeah this video will be going up on the 3rd or 4th of March uh, hopefully it's uploaded t tomorrow so the 3rd of March um, but yeah we'll get straight into it and I'll show you guys everything that I've changed oh yeah and it's not raining how's it not raining um, I'm expanding the path from the farm up to the mob dungeon and you guys are probably thinking what's all this here which I'll show you in two seconds um, but yeah I built the chicken cook, well, chicken factory farm thingy, that's all built up and going. We got dodo eggs coming out of there. We got cooked chickens, cooked dodos, feathers, the whole lot. Um, that's all in there. It's a larger scale of the tutorial I did on the on the channel. Um, we've got melons and pumpkins growing too now, and then. This here is probably the largest project I've done in the last few days. Um, this is mine and Just Endo's build. Just Endo built a church. Well, it's so, supposed to be a church. But yeah, this is um, because we've got villagers in a sort of grind at the moment that aren't really breeding at the moment properly. So we thought we'll go to the next extreme and do it differently. So it's not going to be designed for an iron grinder, nothing like that. Um, it's actually a village, so a proper village. We're hopefully going to get the uh, villagers breeding enough so we can get them, so we can get iron golems naturally spawning to defend our park instead of us having to constantly change it and whatnot. So we're going to get the villagers up here because this is almost finished. We're just going to finish decorating this area, and then we're going to transport the villagers up here. Um, so yeah, I'll show you what we've done um i will not be opening market anymore because they've updated the admin shop now you can pretty much buy absolutely everything um so it, when i need something i usually go there and get it but yeah the park's changed guys not really down there but it's changed there's another exhibit there and one over there uh, yeah um i haven't named any of the dinos whatsoever but oh and we got a mushroom we got a mushroom we'll just add the fact that, that we have a random spawn mushroom um, but yeah we got two Dilophosauruses which you guys can name in the description down below um, so yeah we got two there I want a male and female so name one let's get a boy's name and a girl's name for the Dilophosauruses and then we've got this guy over here this wonderful wonderful gods create well minecraft creation <laughs> um it's an allosaurus guys we're starting to go with the big boys now because we're the only small carnival we have left is the velociraptor which will be going in an exhibit just there but yeah this is the allosaurus exhibit probably more water than land but oh well it looks good um, we started expanding the railway, well, the minecart track as well. Um, oh yeah, and we'll go up and see Jeff. I've had problems with the Dinonychus for the last week. Keeps despawning. 
don't know why, every Dynamicus I own manages to despawn. And you know what? I think this one's done it too. And this one I didn't even own, so... No. Um, let's just run downstairs and find out what's going on with it. See if it's here and if it's not, we're in trouble. It's not here. I think it could possibly be despawning through the um, water, but I don't think it would be. Uh, we'll, we'll try something different. I reckon we can build it like this. Put a, another piece of coal stone, I don't know. Here, here, put another leaf block here and here and break that sand block. Now break that piece of stone and replace it with that. Yeah, that may be what it is, it may be drowning in the water. Yeah, well, so I, bu I built a bridge. It's a bridge. We, we've done one thing this episode. And if we got Dynonychus egg, we'll hatch the Dynonychus. Um, but yeah, so a lot's changed, as you can probably tell. Um, but we do have one more really big project to show off. Um, that Just Sendo and I have done. It is... Where is it? Where is it? Ah, uh, I remember now. Okay, it's something that probably should have been done from the beginning. But the I was a bit slack, but I really got sick of it, so I thought I better get it done now. And so I did. Voila! It is complete. This was going to be rooms, but the storage room downstairs got full, so we built this. A a new and improved storage room that has pretty much a chest for everything swords, bows and arrows, armor, horse armor, pickaxes, axes, potions, books, buckets, uh, rotten flesh, butter ice, gunpowder, all the mob drops, uh, cobblestone, smooth stone, stone bricks, all the things you can make with wood, diamonds, diamonds. <laughs> Yeah, so rails, minecarts, saddles, the whole lot. Um, and then we got this little room here. It's another time machine, guys. We got a second time machine. Uh, but yeah, I'll run back downstairs and I'll show off another chest, just because I feel like being a show off. Um, more, <laughs> more. Look at all that. We now have a lot of diamonds, guys. And I mean a lot of diamonds. Um, and we've got more DNA. Embryos and eggs are starting to come along really well now. Uh, so we'll probably do the Velociraptors next. Oh, we got a Dynonychus egg. We'll take that with us. And yeah, at the moment there's no one on the server. Thought it'd be a good time to record so then we're not getting chat spammed either from everybody and really gives us some time to do well really record this episode without getting spammed considering it's an updated update episode. Um so I'll probably upload a video every two to three days guys. I wanna get about four to five videos out a week if I can. Um but more than likely only four videos a week, so probably Tuesdays, Thursdays, Saturdays, and I'm just trying to think. Probably Mondays. Except for today. Well, t yesterday. Tomorrow. I don't know, I'm confused. <laughs> but yeah, so that's the update of this, guys. Um, really, we're waiting for daytime now, so we can go hatch this Dynonychus. Um, but yeah, I'll show you guys what I mean by no longer having a market. Up the hill, up the hill. 
no longer having a market. It, it, I sort of ripped it down um, when it when I looked at the new admin shop and yeah, so I ripped it down and kept all the quartz and probably build a giant lab with them. I'm thinking build like a big lab building in the middle of the park or something. Get Just Endo's help with that as well. Well, considering now Just Endo's in the fact pretty much is helping with everything now. We do the whole building the park and everything together. Um, but yeah, so the park's going to be really spaced out now, as you can see we now have a lot of power with the faction. Um, we still got 32 claims that we can do, so we can still expand the park a fair bit. Um, we'll probably actually, we'll work on the Velociraptor pen next, and then we will work on the Mosasaurus and Leopurodon, Leo, Leopurodon exhibits next. Um, probably what we'll do oh daytime sweet we'll go hatch this time I guess we'll go we'll go hatch the Jeff the fourth yeah Jeff the fourth is the fourth uh, right there we'll hatch him on the leaves okay um four four percent so he's either gonna go being hatched in that biome or that biome, but yeah, um, we want to get another Dinonychus in this pen. So leave down in the comments down below. Remember to get, leave a name for the, a male and female Dilophosaurus, and leave down a name for a female Dinonychus. Um, so then we can give a good choice of what's going on and. We need one more name, so that's four names that we need. Uh, we need a name for the Allosaurus, male or female. Haven't decided what it is. All we know, it's there. It needs to be named. It's male or female. Um, so yeah, I'll probably do the first people to comment names down below that are responsible names. First people that leave nice names down below, uh, we'll probably choose them straight off the top. Even if I don't like it, if I like it, even better. But if I don't like it, it'll probably still get chosen. Um, so yes, now we just gotta wait the the long and awful wait of waiting for the uh, eggs to hatch. Piece of cobblestone down there. Main. Uh, we'll fill that one in. Fill that one in. Just to get it out momentarily. <laughs> but yeah, that may be what was causing the the Dinonychus to constantly die. Was it was glitching into the water. Um, and drowning. I'm hoping that's what it was. Um, oh, we'll put another leaf block there and one there. No, we don't want one there. We'll put one there. Break that one and put one there. Yeah. Um, hatching. Hopefully not under a block. All good. So yeah, we got pumpkin. That dispenser for the eggs. We're at ninety two percent guys, ninety two percent. I can't believe it. Jeff the fourth will be hatched in four, three, two, one. Bye bye. The new Jeff is brown. Hello Jeff. How you going, Jeff? you ate all of it. You ate all my chicken. How greedy are you? How greedy are you? Okay, we'll go back to the base. Quickly go for a quick run. We go to the chicken farm. Alright, um get two stacks of eggs as well. I'll see if I can get him to eat dodos. Yum yum no no no. How much hunger does that give you? I don't know, I've never checked. It gives you a fair bit actually. I'd rather get you to eat dodos. There's a, oh, three of them. Another one. Are you full? 
You're not full. Oh. I ate the chicken instead. No, no, no. You won that dodo pretty bad. Oh, yeah, you're full. Leave the poor dodo alone. That dodo is going to be dead when he gets hungry. Um, but yeah, so we'll head over into the Allosaurus pan. Uh, we'll feed this guy some dodos. Man, you got a few dodos over there for you to eat, buddy. I've I've learnt that he never eats completely, so he can hunt those dodos when he gets hungry now. And we'll run around here. The path's not done yet, so it's a bit hard not to run and jump. I get annoyed when I'm running and jumping because to me it just looks silly. But yeah, so feed you. You were really hungry. And we'll feed you. You were really hungry too. And I've got no dodos to give you guys, sorry. But yeah, alright guys, um, I know we didn't build anything this episode. Um, but we'll be back again Thursday with another episode. And we'll probably... I should have all this deck ready because that would be a very boring episode for you guys. Um... And we'll probably actually work on getting the villagers up here if they're not already up here. Um, do that next episode. Um, and I'm just trying to think what else we can do next episode. Probably start work on the Mosasaurus exhibit or the Velociraptor. But yeah, alright guys, this is the end of this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you haven't subscribed already, please hit that subscribe button. Really appreciate it. And if you like to see more Minecraft dinosaurs, just smash that like button as well. I know I don't have very many subscribers, but hey, you never know. Alright guys, hope you've enjoyed this episode of Minecraft Dinosaurs, and I'll see you guys all next time with more dinosaurs.